In this segment, we're going to talk about the proper preparation of meat prior to grinding in our LEM Big Bite Grinder. There's three important steps that should really be done in preparing the meat. The first is removing any silver skin on the meat. This is especially prevalent when you deal with venison. Silver skin looks very similar to this right here on the edge. You will want to remove that from the meat before you actually make the meat ready, prepare the meat for grinding. The second thing that you will want to remove, and this is especially true when you're using venison, is any fat, such as what you see right here. So what you will want to do is cut all of that fat out of the meat. The third thing that you want to remove from the meat is any sinew that you might find or gristle in the meat. That would look very similar to what you see right here. The reason why you do those three things is to improve, quite frankly, the taste and the quality of the meat that you grind, as well as getting rid of the gristle and the sinew and the silver skin that may clog up the big bite grinder. Even though our grinders have a lot of torque and a lot of power and will cut through this, the primary reason for doing this again is to improve the quality of the meat that you're preparing. After you removed all of the fat, gristle, and the sinew, you cut the meat up into cube-sized pieces that are approximately two inches square like you see right here. You need to cut it up at the proper size so it will feed down the chute of the grinder. Once all the sinew gristle and fat is removed and the meat is cut up in the proper size cubes, we're then able to feed it into the grinder.